okay so i took a few days off from doing videos and now i'm finally back home after sleeping a lot because of my lack of sleep last may 1st when i attended the nft metaverse game fire 2022 event at the cove manila in okada and speaking of that event i want to share my overall experience about it so you better stay tuned until the end of this video So what's up peeps this is jeff aka nomad fury and we're back once again for another video so this is going to be my first video for may 2022 about the nft metaverse game fight 2022 event i'm going to share to you guys about my overall experience and thoughts about it so several hours before the uh, much anticipated event i woke up early in the morning around 4 a.m i only had less than three hours of sleep that time because well i got a lot of stuff to do but it didn't matter because the excitement is here you know it's two years and four months and counting that i didn't travel outside of the negros island because of the covid19 pandemic so I was on the first flight around 6.30 a.m. and then I arrived at Naiya after an hour and 20 minutes of plane ride. Around noon time, I went straight to the venue which is Okada. Even though the event would begin around 5 in the afternoon, I decided to be early rather than worrying later about the traffic. Okada was one of the biggest casino hotels in the Philippines and I've been there a few times before the COVID-19 pandemic. As I headed to the booth, I've seen so many people lining up for registrations and the excitement was there. I took my time to take some photos and a few clips before verifying my registration since only the white listed guests are allowed to enter in which i am one of them and of course no qr code no entry as i've successfully entered the cove in okada i am freaking blown away on what i've seen everything right there this is way beyond my initial expectations the organizers known as block tides asia token fund news coin voice and ac capital are doing absolutely great to make the nft metaverse game fight 2022 event stupendous i really mean it I've reunited and reconnected with some of my crypto friends and colleagues that I have met years ago and also meeting the new guys and gals in the space. It's been more than two years that I haven't attended a physically crypto related event. So yeah, this was a great moment for me. You know, I've been in a lot of crypto and blockchain meetups, conferences and summits both here in the Philippines and overseas in the past. But this event is really something else because it focuses specifically on NFTs, Metaverse, Game 5, Play to Earn and so on. The Cryptoverse is expanding. And about the program flow of the event it really went well from project presentations like paymaya who is now known as maya crypto.com coinex and so on to interesting panel discussions with some of the familiar faces that i have met like myrtle ann ramos of block ties and place war emerson fonseca of nem philippines mam gil cruz macapagal floy way coco and the other ones out there shout out to you guys by the way also we have various intermission numbers that are more on dancing with neon lights interesting cosplays and so much more and of course I've met some of the celebrities like the lovely and gorgeous Yassi Pressman in which I remember that she is owning lots of axes and also Kamikaze who treated all of us up close and personal with their amazing live performances as the event is coming to a close shout out to you guys by the way and i definitely like the setup of the booths such as place war gala games arcos open blocks mecha morphing covenant child rose on and so on just to name a few where i gained some freebies to take home with me especially baby shark bubble from friends in which i briefly played their p2e game before it launches in the public shout out to that big korean guy who i believe is part of their team who recorded this short clip for me i had so much fun by the way i took my time doing that working with those guys in which i am trying to come up with some sort of partnerships collaborations and so on even though that i am super tired because of my lack of sleep i'm just so excited of course i love the food even though that the line is very long it's worth the wait and i just ate a lot but of course since i am on a ketogenic low carb diet well this is just once in a while so this is truly an unforgettable experience for me and i would forever treasure it i just want to say thank you for this extraordinary event of a lifetime here in the philippines it's it's really worth my time hopefully there will be more events like this in the philippines as we are slowly moving on from the covid19 pandemic i just hope that there will be no more future lockdowns for these events to continue hopefully you've enjoyed and learned about my experience and thoughts about the nft metaverse game fire 2022 event that i have attended for me this is one of those nights that i will never ever forget and hopefully i'll be seeing them in the future nft metaverse and game fire events this year and in more years to come anyway guys thank you so much for watching this video of mine so i'll see you guys again very soon